To determine the correct working end of an H67 on the anterior teeth, there are two ways to do this. One way is to fulcrum on the canine, place the instrument on the central, and then look for the end where the terminal shank is more parallel to the long axis of the tooth. It can be tricky if you move your fulcrum position at all. So what I would suggest is that you keep your fulcrum in place, you use your opposite end to turn the instrument, and then look at which one is the terminal shank more parallel to the long axis of the tooth. This one you can see crosses the tooth and is incorrect. This is the correct working end for mandibular anterior surfaces towards. This is the six end. When working on the away surfaces, I'm working mandibular anterior surfaces away sitting at 12 o'clock. Fulcrum on the canine, hold the instrument on the central and again, look for the end where the terminal shank is more parallel. This end, you can see again, crosses the tooth. This end is more parallel. It is the seven. When switching to the lingual surfaces, Remember that you always need to switch ends for the same tooth, same towards or away, so in this case, away surface on the lingual. It will be difficult to be able to see the same, to see which working end is correct on the lingual. So the recommendation is find the correct working end on the facial, and you're going to stay in the same clock position surface away, flip ends for the lingual. The other option for finding the correct working end is to hold the instrument so that the terminal shank is parallel with the long axis of the tooth and then look to see which way the handle points towards. So in this case, I'm holding the instrument between teeth numbers eight and nine, and you can see that the handle is pointing towards the mesial surface or the toward surface of tooth number nine. This indicates that this is the correct working end for this area. This end is the seven. Maxillary anterior surfaces towards is the seven. If I hold the opposite end in the same place, again, I have the terminal shank parallel to the long axis of the tooth, and I can see that the handle is pointing towards the mesial portion or the away surface of tooth number eight. This is the correct end for the away surfaces maxillary facial. I would come to 12 o'clock and use this end for this site. Again, once you've found the correct working end on the facials, you can then stay in the same clock position, stay on the away surface, and flip ends to instrument the lingual maxillary, anterior, surface away, lingual.